is breaking news from Channel 13 Eyewitness News. The only thing they had left in this world. A mother of five children was shot and killed while at a local bar. That's just one of the shootings that took the lives of seven people across Indianapolis over the weekend. And we've learned today the victims of those crimes range in age from 76 to a 16-year-old. And that teenager just died in the last few hours. He is now the seventh victim from this violent weekend in Indianapolis. Tonight at 5 o'clock, our own Rich Van Wyk has that breaking story and also an arrest in the case. This is where the crime ended, off the road, across the sidewalk, across the grass, in a drainage ditch in the middle of this Beech Grove middle-class neighborhood. Just after 3 o'clock Sunday morning, gunfire brought Beech Grove police to Greenwood Drive. They found a car off the road, down a ditch, on fire with a critically injured teenager behind the wheel. Today, close family friends identified the boy as former Cecina High School student Xavier Weir. Tabitha May went online, appealing for prayers and contributions for Weir and his family. Xavier is still on life support, she wrote, and there has been no changes. David Bailey had to see the crime scene for himself. Bailey is a friend of the teenager and his family. But I know that he was an athlete. He worked hard. He worked hard outside of just school. He earned his own money. He, he wouldn't care to go cut grass or do what he had to do to earn money to buy his own clothes to help his mother out. Two other teenagers were in the car but weren't seriously hurt. One of them told me they took a wrong turn and were trying to turn around when someone in a car behind them started shooting. Police found a handgun at the crime scene. Late today, Beach Grove police announced they have one suspect, a 16-year-old under arrest. They are looking for yet another suspect. Rich Van Wyk, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.